Hello, my name is Eduardo, and well, I just, uh, I just uplo uh, uploaded the last uh, part of the tutorial about the shopping list planner, okay? And well, after finishing this tutorial, you will be able to have something similar to this. Well, not like this, because I just add some images and change the color just to make it look different, but the same function as I guess you can uh, make it, uh, if you follow the tutorial. Well, I just will show you the final app, okay, so I just build it, and you have in here right items, well, you have to save your items there, so for example, you can add uh, lemon, lemons, lemons, okay, you save the item, maybe some nuggets, okay, uh, maybe some napkins maybe some watermelon eggs mm -hmm. uh, maybe some bananas uh, juice uh, maybe oil olive oil maybe and vinegar and that's it you can check your list in here so this is the list that we have i have a previous list uh, list say before okay so in that case you can have uh, your list you can use it for example i say you know what i have to go shopping later so i plan my list and then i just save my list and close the app and that's it so then i start my list again because now i am ready to shop i i have i check here i have my shopping list with all the stuff in there and then i just go shopping and in here i have this thing okay so i start like getting the tortillas so and then i say for example it is like 12 pesos and i bought three kilos we like uh, tortillas we add this thing to the subtotal and then i go on i couldn't find the donuts and then the nuggets so nuggets maybe it is like 125 pesos just one bag then some chicken okay chicken maybe it was like uh, 75 pesos and I bought two kilos I add this and then maybe ketchup it was like 20 pesos I added tuna fish so it was like 9.5 pesos and I bought eight cans I add this and maybe I couldn't find these things and maybe nuggets not necessary anymore lemons uh, well what about lemon it was like 20 pesos a kilo and I bought two kilos and then maybe watermelon it was like 56 pesos for the watermelon for the eggs uh, 42 pesos and I bought two kilos and maybe for the juice 45 pesos and I add this then when you finish your list you save your shopping stuff okay so you can erase here if you want to start again and check you save and you have these buttons to appear in here that is check my list that is just a list picker you check all the items you bought just to make sure and if you finish shopping you can go in here and then you have this kind of report i spent today 632 pesos and the items i bought were and it these are the things that i bought and the things that uh, i couldn't uh, get okay now i want to you can send this to your email for example I say I send this to my email 
as a O2, then at gmail dot com. So then you send to your email. Then you just finish this. This is an activity starter, okay? Just one. It has all this information in your mail. Did you check? Auto automatically, you have the shopping list, the date, and then you have this, okay? The quantity you spent, the items you got, and the items you couldn't uh, get. Now did you send it. And that's it then you will receive the email and you have your list well basically that is the idea so I just encourage you to go and check uh, the tutorial part 2 it's pretty interesting okay and this is what the thing I, I, I just received okay my shopping list from March uh, 25 you enter to this and it's the same thing that we just checked okay well so i hope you like this thing and please guys share this with your friends and also try to make this app okay it is really interesting and you just see um, just adding some simple graphics and some color it looks pretty good okay so um well i will see you next time bye bye